Um, I think back in 2013, it's already three years ago, but already at that time, digital was already around us. So it was not that we were first movers. So there were a lot of examples around us where we could see the benefits of moving in this, uh, in this direction. And the reason why we did so is that we were fully convinced uh, about the direction and the belief that it's better to be first than to, than to be last. Um, so like I shared in the session uh, of today is that the risk of being too late or the penalty of being too late is much higher than the penalty of, of being too early. Major elements in the success of our digital transformation were um, clearly that at the start of the project there was clear commitment from the top, which I think typically is difficult in companies. So uh, typically you have at the top you have 60 plus year old grey men uh, who are less involved in the digital uh, technology and are less involved in the benefits which it could bring. Uh, so in case you don't get that kind of support, it will be very difficult to drive a uh, drive transformation. Um, other building blocks which are very important, so there's a lot about culture. You need to create the DNA, you need to change the DNA of your company to make this transformation successful. So it's a different way of thinking. Uh, for example, there's a lot of more possibilities on experimenting. Where in the past there was a philosophy, hey, once you do it, it needs to be good. Now you can just try and test if it's good. And if it's not good, then you just try something else. So it's a different type of culture. Second, we changed a lot of uh, processes, the way how we do things. So also when you think about controls, it's very different in the new world versus the old world. Um, there's an element about tooling. Um, classically, Philips had the idea to develop a lot of tooling itself. And during our journey, we came to understand that there are much better tools available outside the company. So we, we acquired a lot of tooling uh, and going forward, we will do that even more. Um, and uh, last but not least, there is also a lot about uh, skills. So we trained a lot uh, intensively, classroom training, on, uh, on the floor training. But at the same time, we also hired a lot of new people in this, uh, in this area to get the right capabilities on board.